According to researchers at Penn State and two universities in China, a new supercapacitor based on manganese oxide uh, could combine the storage capacity of batteries with the high power and fast charging of other supercapacitors. By combining with cobalt manganese oxide, manganese oxide forms a heterostructure in which the researchers are able to tune the interfacial properties. The group started with simulations to see how manganese oxide's properties change when coupled with other materials. When they coupled it to a semiconductor, they found it made a conductive interface with a low resistance to electron and ion transport. This will be important because otherwise the material would be slow to charge. Exploring manganese oxide with the cobalt manganese oxide as a positive electrode and a form of graphene oxide as a negative electrode yields an asymmetric supercapacitor with high energy density, remarkable power density and excellent cycling stability. The group has compared their supercapacitor to others and uh, theirs has much higher energy density and power. They believe that by scaling up their lateral dimensions and thickness, their material has the potential to be used in electric vehicles. So far, they have not tried to scale it up. Instead, the next step will be to tune the interface where the semiconducting and conducting layers meet for even better performance. They want to add the supercapacitor to already developed uh, flexible wearable electronics and uh, sensors as an energy supply for those devices or directly as uh, self-powered sensors.